Hello, fellow Springfieldians. It's me, Hello Arthur here. And we're coming back for another tips and tricks video. Yes, yeah, so this one is going to be on the top nine prizes in the yearbook mystery box. And so as you'll see, it is um, part one. So we're going to make a full guide on it. So I think the next video might be um, what um, what prizes in the yearbook mystery box um, look like characters, but they're actually NPCs. So I'm going to be doing a small series on it. So yeah, so basically, um, before we get start, I would really appreciate it if you hit that subscribe button and also check the description box out for loads of cool stuff. So here we go, let's get into it. Okay, so um, I've decided that this is the best um, the best um, prize in the whole of the yearbook mystery box, purely because they earn three times the cash of of a um, a premium character. So it's it, it's basically earn the amount that three premium characters do. So you'll see that um, there's the um, there's all the money there for, for so sixty minutes. 315 cash, 24 hours, 2,700 cash, and that is multiplied by three-ish. I think as you get higher, it um, the multiplier increases. But yes, um, and this is one one prize just to clarify. So it's a really good deal if you can just if you can unlock this because you're going to be getting so much money for your development of your town. And so when I talk about the bonuses, I mean like so if they're handy to help with like the monorail, so they're better at collecting certain currencies and the Wiccans this one um, isn't what like that anyway okay so coming in at number two is the tourist bundle so yes again um, well it's a bit different but because these are three separate characters but they come as one bundle as a prize in the mystery box but basically um, they almost earn as much as the Wiccans do, a little bit less because of the um, the tourist child. He earns a little bit less for some reason. But yeah, um, again, if you can get this prize, then you'll be earning tons of money um, for your town and a great deal for 30 donuts. Okay, so then coming it in at number three is the Mexican Duffman Bundle. So yeah, we've got Lady Duff um the mexican duffman and i did add in add in duffman at the back there as well because he does actually come in the bundle if you unlock it um and yes um a quick tip other than um this is basically you should get the mexican duffman bundle instead of the duff fury just with duffman because you can get another character and a skin um for the same amount of donuts um as if you were going to be getting the Duff Bury. It's just called a different thing, and it's really misleading, because Duff Man isn't in the actual in-game picture. But um, yes, it does come with it, and Lady Duff is a skin for Duff Man. So anyway, so yep, yeah, there's a bonus, because Duff Man earns um, the, the yoga mats um, for the Springfield Heights, so that is going to be a character that will help out with that. And I will be making another video and all of the characters that do help out with certain missions, like for the monorail quest, the heights quest, the redwood tree, it could be all the money mountain. So yeah, I'm going to be getting into all of that in a separate video. So as you'll see, every eight hours, um, the Duff Man will, uh, will earn 60 um, yoga mats. So that is, you could say that's a bit, um, you could say it's useful or not useful, it depends on your way of playing. And then... Yes, so there we go. And then, so we've got Brandine for 30 donuts. And so, yep, she's got some bonus urns, which is going to be the trash. She earns 50% more. And the metal, she'll earn 50% more. So, yes, that's very nice. Um, but the, so the great thing about Brandine is that she can, she can give birth to three sparkler brads hey. and so you'll see the um the chart so every 24 hours if you collect after all of these different time periods um daily you will earn 500 cash from each one of them and i know that um you have to do the, 
birth another Spuckler bred quest. And that does take 90 days to complete, but you can speed it up for 30 donuts. Um, so you could get a um, cash earning character for 30 donuts straight away. But if you are going to wait, it's a long time. Um, but eventually, when, once you do have all of the Spuckler brads born, um, you're going to be making a lot of money, which is going to be more than the equivalent of two playable characters. So, and yeah, the Spuckler brads are pretty cool. Um, so yeah, that's why Brandiness came in at number four, and also she does have bonus earns as well, which, yeah. Okay, so the next one, these, the, the rest of them are just going to be things in the open mystery box, which have two characters. So this one is the Sun Gazer Tour Bus, so we've got, um, Freddie Freeman, and I can't remember the other one. Um, I'll just remember, it is Shredder Stevens, yes. Okay, and so this is for 30 donuts, and so they both, they both um, have all these missions, so 60 minutes, 105 cash, so you're going to be getting um, two characters in one bundle, which is going to be great, so you're going to be earning lots of money. Okay, and so we've got Sherry and Terry. And so, like the Wiccans, this is just one prize. It's not. It looks like two separate characters. It's hard to get your head around. But they actually do earn double the cash on their missions. So you'll see um, a normal character, and then you'll you can double it, and then you get so for example, two hundred and ten for sixty minutes, which is very because um, a normal premium character on its own would produce one hundred and five every sixty minutes. So that's very cool. And so they earn two times the cash in one character, which is nice. Um, but there is no bonus, but, you know, the bonus um, is pretty small. So it's a pretty small factor in this video, in my ranking. Okay, and um, so we've got the Soul Extraction Institute with Robo Burns and Doggy Smithers. And so, yes, they they both have um, those missions for the... Um, money, so 105 cash for 60 minutes and so on. And there is no bonuses, but still, you're going to be unlocking um, two characters, so by all means, get this um, whenever you can, really. And like all of these things, I think I'd advise you to get all of it. I know it's hard. Just keep on refreshing the yearbook until you get a good lineup, maybe with two of these prizes that I've suggested in, and that you know that that will be. A great one to go for. Okay, and so we've got Westminster Abbey with Oscar Wilde and Geoffrey Chaucer. And so they both earn those amounts of cash stated in the chart. And so there is no bonus, but um, yeah, they, they'll earn tons of money if you get that. So yeah, I, um, best of luck with that. Okay, and so we have Patches and Poor Violet. So they're for 30 donuts. There's no bonuses. And like Sharon and Terry, they are one character and one prize. And they're going to earn double the cash. So very nice. And there's the, um, the chart there. Okay, so I hope you found that video useful. And I will be um, making some more videos on the yearbook mystery box because we certainly haven't covered everything. It is a massive box and there is a lot of stuff to be talked about. OK, so I remind you to, that if you enjoyed the video, please leave a like and also hit that subscribe button. So thank you ever so much for watching. I hope you have an awesome rest of your day.